and if we go to the float it doesn't even show up so make sure you include the doc type in the very beginning it's very important it's crucial so if you go back refresh it and everything's back fine let's check it in Internet Explorer 7 copy and paste the link there you go and we have a working CSS menu <clears throat> however if we go to Internet Explorer 6 and we copy and paste the hover does not really work properly <clears throat> there's no sub menu and the reason uh, this is because is I Internet Explorer 6 does not support the hover CSS uh, style or at least it only supports it for uh, link tags so it works for the actual links but it doesn't work for uh, sub menus that are created in separate unordered lists so how we solve that problem is by so the way that we solve uh, the problem in Internet Explorer 6 is by adding some JavaScript so what we're going to do is we're going to uh, co uh, copy and paste a few JavaScripts that have been pre-written route. I'm not going to teach you how to uh, write these JavaScripts because I have not written them myself. These are all open source. So I'm going to just copy and paste some of the JavaScript files I already found. They're jQuery if you know what jQuery is. Let's create a new folder called um, J uh, JavaScript and copy and paste them here and we have uh, three files we have jQuery.js, um, jQuery i6 hover.min.js and i6 6js i6 6js is just a replication of um, the jQuery i6 hover.js uh, but I'm just including both for reference because they're both uh, the Internet Explorer 6 hover plugin from jQuery so let's go back to our main HTML page and add those, uh, link those JavaScripts in. So create another uh, link tag. Actually, how you link JavaScript is not through a link tag. You call, you create a script tag. So script source is going to be JavaScript jQuery, which we have to have at the top. Type is text JavaScript and then close the tag I want to add um, one more We're, this one's going to be uh, jQuery i6 hover dot min dot js and actually we're, we're going to add the last one as well which is going to be i6 dot js so once we've added those back all in, when we refresh this, it should work. Actually, it's not. So I think we have to do one more thing. And I actually made a little bit of a mistake. The reason why it's not working right now, the hover for the JavaScript in Internet Explorer 6, is because I had some typos. So. If I go back to our index.html page, I created some typos in the link. Uh, first of all, let's see, we have to get rid of the jQuery here, and we have to do one more thing, which is we had to get rid of the period right here. So there you go. If I save once again, and if I refresh this. And there you go, in Internet Explorer 6, everything works fine. So thank you for watching my tutorial. Um, if this uh, tutorial helped you at all, please rate and subscribe. Uh, I'm doing this specifically so I can have a tutorial channel on YouTube dedicated just for YouTube. So please do that. And if you have any uh, comments or suggestions, then please write it in the comment section below. And see you guys in the next tutorial.